Andy. Well, the city of Colleen has now seen 13 homicides already in the first 18 weeks of this year alone. And it's easily on pace to surpass homicide numbers for the last three years. But what does the COVID-19 outbreak mean for this trend? Six News reporter Andrew Moore has the details for us tonight. Yeah, the fact is Colleen has seen enough homicides to have a rate of two homicides every three weeks. But when we looked deeper, we found that the main factor here was actually age demographic. In seven out of the last eight homicides, the victims and suspects have all been 19 to 25 years old. Community organizer Lolita Gilmore says the city of Colleen just doesn't have much opportunity to offer that group, and many turn to gangs and drugs to belong. However, after the COVID-19 outbreak, there were no homicides in April, and in the latest case, Monday morning, the victim was much older. Still, young people have less to do right now, and Gilmore says that won't be beneficial in the long run. All these kids are in the homes, and so no one's in school. So we begin to look at that and get an understanding that um, these are contributing factors that's going to escalate, cause things to escalate. Gilmore says she is still working to bring a plan to the city of Clean, providing mentoring programs and other opportunities for young adults in order to reduce crime in the future. The COVID crisis has made things more difficult, but still she hopes to have something to present by the end of the month. Andrew Moore, 6 News. All right, thank you, Andrew. 6 News did reach out to Colleen PD about the recent homicide trend today, but they did not get back to us.